good day everyone hope you are doing great and your preparation is going well and here is another favorite video for the short tricks from neural control and coordination chapter and before that i have also already posted so many short tricks video from the class 11 now i will be posting for class 12 also so please do share and support if you really liking this short trick so without any delay let's start the first short trick from the neural control lesson will be for your human neural system okay the human neural system is divided into two which is your central neural system and peripheral neural system as you all might be knowing so the tricks will be for central neural system it is cbsc so what does it mean the central neural system consists of brain and spinal cord am i right so cbsc c is for your central neural system b is for brain and s is for spinal cord this is for your central neural system so the next one peripheral neural system here we do have two tricks the first one is for pnet okay here p is for your peripheral neural system e is for afferent neurons and a is for afferent neurons right and again your peripheral neural system can be divided into two types right so for that it is soap that is s o for somatic and a for autonomic peripheral neural system okay so are we clear with the central and peripheral neural system now we will move on to type of neurons you might be knowing the neurons are divided into three types based on the number of axon and dendrites present right so the trick will be bro use my car someone is saying a statement bro use my car okay so here br this bro is for b bipolar r is for retina so where you can find the bipolar neurons you can find it in the retina okay now the use in here u is for unipolar and e is for embryonic stage unipolar neurons are found in your embryonic stage coming to my car m is for multipolar c is for cerebral cortex okay so my uh, multipolar and c is for cerebral cortex so these are the tricks for your neuron types based on the axon and dendrites okay now the next one is for generation and conduction of nerve impulse in this the main confusion will be how many uh, sodium or potassium or out or in and then numbers right so the trick will be how many digits are here can you count 1 2 3 there are three letters or digits okay and how many digits are in the out o u t 3 so 3 3 sodium will be out this is a simple trick so what about here 1 2 there are two digits and in also having two digits so 2 so trick is very simple right whenever you are confused how many sodium is going out there should be three sodium and it is o u t there are three words and whether sodium or potassium is going out you can see na plus it is having three digits so it will go out okay so 3 na plus out 2 k plus in next we are going to see the talk about the central neural system so the central neural system is nothing but you are mainly focusing on your brain and you might be knowing our brain is covered with three layers right what are those three layers the trick will be pad P A D, pyramidal arachnoid membrane and your dura meter. Okay, this is in the uh, from the inner to the outermost, inner, middle, and your outermost. Now you might be confused which is the inner layer or outer layer. So for that also I have given the tricks that will be during outing arrange medium pizza in car. You are saying to your friend we are going for an outing, so we might be feeling angry, no? So during outing arrange medium pizza in the car. Okay, so during. is for dura meter outing is for outer okay the first two is for dura meter and the first is for dura meter and outing is for outer arrange is for your arachnoid membrane and medium is for middle so dura meter is outer arachnoid is middle and pizza is for your pia meter and in is for inside now you won't be having any confusion with this also okay are we clear with this page we have seen about the human neural system what are the types central and peripheral and the short tricks for that then we also talked about the types of neuron based on axon and dendrites count and the uh, potassium sodium pump that one and also we talked about the central neural system that is your brain what are the coverings and what are the layer how to memorize it the next will be your brain what are the parts of the brain this is easy still i have made a trick okay so the trick will be be brave for mild hindrance in our life we will be facing so many hindrance or obstacle okay but we should be brave for the mild one okay so be brave for mild hindrance b is for your brain and what are the parts here for for brain mild mid brain hind 
hind brain okay so these are the three parts of your brain now now the trick for the parts of forebrain will be pay for her cat okay pay for her cat your friend is saying pay for her cat so pay is nothing and four is for your forebrain her h is for your hypothalamus and the cat c is for your cerebrum and t is for thalamus thalamus is already part of your hypothalamus so you won't be forgetting it so are we clear with forebrain now coming to hind brain you are head pcm okay head pcm usually biology students will be eating physics chemistry and maths okay you might be uh, also facing the same issue so it is for pcm okay uh, let me mark it give me a minute yeah so head is for your hind brain or hind brain and p is for pons c is for cerebellum m is for medulla so for hind brain what are you going to remember what are the subject you are going to head head pcn okay now we will see the short tricks for functions of the each part of the brain okay these are might be from the forebrain or mid mid i haven't mentioned here just uh, remember the parts and their functions okay now for the corpus callosum the trick will be call and connect to hema someone is ordering call and connect to hema so what is this call is for connect okay call is for cerebral both c are there no what i want to tell is here call and connect means you can easily connect with the word collasm corpus collasm okay and to hema hema is your hemisphere what are the hemisphere cerebral hemisphere we do have four cerebral hemisphere right that one so call and connect to hema is nothing but to connecting cerebral hemisphere okay now thalamus thalamus is the word must okay m for motor s for sensory t is for your thalamus so thalamus deals with major of your motor and sensory areas now coming to hypothalamus the trick will be eat drink water in high temperature eat drink water in high temperature okay so you need to drink water in high temperature also you need to eat so eat is for eating drink is for drinking or uh, and coming to high temperature high hypo temperature is for thalamus also it also deals with your temperature okay so now your hypothalamus deals with your eating drinking and your temperature maintenance okay so that's why i have mentioned temperature also are we clear with hypothalamus moving to the next one your medulla oblongata it is for all the cricket fans over that my rcb guys okay my rcp guys so what is this my for medulla r is for respiration c is for cardiovascular reflex and guys is for gastric secretion so these are the function uh, taken care by your medulla oblongata okay so here we have dealt with the parts of the brain and within forebrain and hind brain we have also seen the uh, parts of them and the tricks for that and these are the functions of few and i have mentioned the trick for that also so i have already mentioned a playlist where all the tricks are mentioned if you feel this is very fast please do see it in the slow mode and let me know if you want anything and join the telegram channel bye bye see you in the next video